Hello everyone, Miss Tabitha here. I'm at Doosage and I'm in the green room and I'm gonna be doing a lyrical warm up today. So I'm going to be facing the opposite way. That way when you're looking at the video, you can participate and do it with me. So we're going to be warming up our head and our shoulders and our tummy and our gluteus. We're gonna be warming up our feet, doing uh, presages and tendus and degages and rond de jambes. Then I'm gonna be doing across the floor and stretching. Um, so make sure your dance space is clear of all debris. So if you're in the living room, like push back a coffee table, make sure there's nothing like on the floor that you could trip or fall or get hurt on, okay? Um, I hope you're having fun at home, doing your online schooling, doing your online dance classes. Stay active, stay positive, and um, let's get ready for the article. Now the other way. Looking down and up. Side to side. Tilt again. Shoulders. Start with our feet, presages, plies, tendus, degages, and rond de jambes. Okay. too far forward or too far back. When we're in our first position, keep your natural first position. Don't 
force it so it's a straight line. Your natural first should be about there. We don't want putting extra pressure on your knees or your hips, okay? Now remember, like your plies, we want them elastic, like rubber bands. Pull and tighten, pull and tighten. We don't want you to drop, pick it up. Drop, pick it up. Use your muscles, go slowly down and come slowly back up. Ready? I could probably do plies facing you. Starting and parallel. Hands on hips, plie, and up, plie, up, plie, up, plie. Take a balance. How's your balancing? And so first, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Up, take the balance. Make sure you're engaging your abdomen, your glutes. Knees are locked, legs are straight. Looking up, if you look down, you fall down. There we go. So now we're going to do plie, four starch, releve, come down. Plie, four starch, releve, come down. Plie. Four starch, releve, come down, plie, four starch, releve, now reverse it, go up, four starch, heels down, and straight, up, four starch, heels down, and straight, up, four starch, heels down, and straight, up, four starch, heels down, slow plie, plie, and straight. And plie, and straight, and plie, and straight, and plie, straight. Now in second, plie, and straight, plie, and straight, and plie, and straight, and plie. And straight. Take a lateral stretch to the side. And make it to a flat back. Curl it up. Arch back. And release. Down to your ankle. Down to the center. Rolling it up slowly. Now the other way, stretching to the side. And flat back to the diagonal. Rolling up, arching back, taking it down to the ankle. And to the center, rolling it up slowly, and circle that head. How'd you do? Good. All right, now it's time for Tom to do's. I'm going to go ahead and turn around for this one. That way you can do it watching me and not be confused left or right which way. In parallel first, and then we'll go into first. Front and in. Front and in. Front and in. Parallel to this side. We go side. In. Two. Three, four, to the back. One, two, three, four, to the side. Four, one, two, three, four. Bring it up to rear tray in parallel and balance. Now the left side. One. Two, three, four, to the side, one, two, three, four, to the back, one, two, three, four, to the side, one, 
two, three, four, balancing, same thing again in first position this time, okay? First position, four front side, back side. So now we're going to do rond de jambes. Rond de jambes means circle of the leg. You're making the letter D or a half circle, semicircle. You're going front, side, back, and then bringing it back through first position. When we go to the front, side, back, it's called rond de jambes on day or out the door. When we do it backwards, going back, side, front, it's called rond de jambes on day dawn in the pond. So it goes back, side, front, and in. So we're going to do Ronde Jean Mondé Or and Ronde Jean Mondé Dawn in first position, um, left and right. So those are very slow to the, you can be precise. Front, side, back, in. Now we're going to make them more lyrical instead of ballet. And so we're going to be doing them with a plie, crossing over, going around, straightening, bringing it back in. Plie, crossing it over, bring it back, and in. So this is going to be crossing because we're going to 
you know, be more lyrical about it. Okay, so we're going to do that backwards and forwards, and it's a little bit more smoother. Okay, so it shouldn't stop. It should continue to go the whole time. You ready? And... So do you see the difference between our very precise ballet positions and our ballet rond de jambes and then making the same movement with the ballet rond de jambes and making it more lyrical, making it more fluid. Yes, we're still hitting that first position as we go through. We're still bending, we're straightening, but we're leaning, we're lifting, we're looking up as our hands as we're moving. That's the most important part, right? Straight on, 
and leaning back in front. Okay? Try it with me. No arms at first. Side, rock, back, and front. 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 Add the arm, side. Rock back and front, 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 side. Rock back and front of the chest, side. Rock back and front, side. Rock back and front, side. Rock back and front. How do you do those waltz or those <laughs> balling days? Okay. Um, next, I want you to work on your um, your turns. Okay. So, if you are on tile, be careful. Okay. Um, a sock. But let's make sure it's not too slippery. Right. That we're going to trip and fall. So, when working on our turns, um, first we're going to do PKs. Okay, PK balances and then PK turns. And then we'll work on pirouettes, okay? So, PK turns, well, PK balances first. Do your hands and your hips just at first. This leg is bent, this leg is straight, and you're stepping up, and you step back down. Step up, and back down. Up, and back down. Up, we're going to switch the other way. And, up, and back down. Up, and back down, up, and back down, up, and back down, okay? Um, now, to make it a turn, you're going to bring it here with your arms, and then when you go up, you're going to go here, and you turn around, okay? I'm gonna do it facing the other way, that way you can follow along at home. Make sure that you're really up on your forced arch, okay? So we don't want our foot flat and trying to turn flat-footed, uh, that's not going to work. You can trip, you can fall, you get hurt, something we do it. You do it up on your relevé. So you should be up. Oh, you can't see my feet. You should do it up here. You should be turning flat footed. Okay? And when we're up on our toe, remember like some of the other videos have done about warming up your feet and brassages, you have to be right up over it. If you're out like this, that's bad pressure on your ankles, on your knees. You have to be in one straight line. Okay? So your hips over your knees, your knees over your ankles, your ankles over your toes. We don't want it going out or in because we don't want you getting hurt. All right, so let's practice our PK turns. How'd you do? Did you remember to spot? Totally forgot to talk about that. So when you're spotting, let's say I'm going to do a turn here. I'm going to spot you. So my head is looking, 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 snap, and then I bring it back around. So if I'm turning, I'm going look, 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 snap. That keeps you focused, it keeps you balanced, it keeps you turning, it keeps your body going, okay? So don't forget to spot. Now to the left. How'd you do? So now, if we're going to do a PK turning, I'm going to do it facing, going towards you, and then coming away from you, that way you can practice it this way as well. And here and here, I'll go up to PK, I step down, and then I prepare again. Up to PK, step down, prepare. Up to PK, step down, prepare. How was that? I'm going to do it going back the other way so you can practice at home too. to the air. Hopefully you're practicing at home with me. Uh, okay, so 
now for pirouettes. So first, I'm going to fourth, and we're going to do it in parallel. So you're going to just take a fourth position. You're going to plie, bringing it up, and balancing. So back, up, balance. Back, balance. I'm going to do the other so you can follow along. Back, up, balance. Back, up, balance. Now, try turning. Down, up, down. I step back again with my right foot. So if I my right foot's back, I'm gonna bring it up, stepping back and plie. Your plie is your, your go, it's your energy, it's your push to turn, okay? So you have to plie, you go up, you spot to turn. Not your arms getting around, it's your spotting, okay? And then you step it back down. All right, now let's try it to the left, okay? Same thing, arms just switched. So you're here and your left foot is back. You're going to turn and step it back out. All right, so we're gonna call it a quick just that, that part today. So we did a nice warm up, we worked on um, balances, triple steps, PKs, and pirouettes. All right, make sure you're practicing your recital videos. Maybe try to win one of the combinations that we posted or whatever, and I'll continue to post. Stay active at home, guys. Bye.